It's fast becoming one of the most popular sports in the country, and with good reason too. Not only is Rugby Sevens a fast and exciting sport to play and watch, but it's also now an Olympic sport for 2016. And in the senior women's squad, there are two Indigenous players. I caught up with one of them at training today. The Australian Women's Sevens Rugby squad will head to Dubai in the coming days for the opener of the World Rugby Sevens Series. Head coach Tim Walsh named his 13-strong squad, which includes Tanisha Stanton. The forward, who turns 19 next month, is still pinching herself that she's playing for Australia, given she only made the switch to the code a short time ago. I was quite shocked actually, just because I've only been here for two months, I thought, um, you know, I might need a little bit more experience under my belt, a um, little more training, get the fitness up and stuff like that. I was hoping um, to tour next year, but, you know, jumping in the green and gold straight away, um, being selected in the, you know, the 13 is so exciting and I'm absolutely over the moon, I can't wait. Stanton has talent to burn and has displayed skills in netball, rugby league and touch football with representative honours in those sports. She says the transition across to Rugby Sevens was a challenge, but praised the players and coaching staff for their support. Even just pulling me aside for quick chats or having meetings with them um, so they can lay down the platform for me and let me know what they want out of me um, and helping me where, with areas that I didn't understand with the rules and things like that and learning technique with contact. Our contact coach helped me a lot out with that. Such a great culture, it's such a great environment to be around and I'm just really glad I'm a part of it. Tim Walsh said Stanton had shown him and the Australian coaching staff that she was ready and likes what he sees from Stanton and her amazing rapid progress in the code. She's learning the game quickly, um, but she's a very, very powerful and skillful player, which is where you know we, we hope to use her um, in, our, in that sort of style of play. Um, already she's shown a fantastic um, um, desire for, for contact and then her ability to to throw the offload as well, so it's uh, in a game of sevens, uh, very valuable. The sevens forward was also proud that another Indigenous female is in the Australian squad. Talina Simon showed what she's capable of when the side toured Fiji recently, showing a clean pair of heels as she carved up the opposition with a bag full of tries. Stanton says Simon is an amazing talent. It's absolutely great to have a sister right next to me um, and she's going unreal and played so good at Fiji um, only a couple of weeks ago and you know she has just even more great things to come and you know it's so great to have her running beside me at training and off the field as well having her there for support and stuff like that and I just can't wait to see you know more sisters come through. Tanisha Stanton and the Australian side will play South Africa, France and Spain in their pool. The World Rugby Seven Series is an important tournament given that a top four finish will secure automatic qualification for the Rio Olympics.